Now, inflation is driving up the cost of nearly everything. That includes road construction projects. It's forcing El Paso County to seek an additional $10 million for improvements at the end of South Academy Boulevard. And that's where we find CARDIO News Channel 13 Scott Harrison live looking into how that money will be used. Well, this morning, El Paso County's head engineer got permission from the County Board of Commissioners to apply for federal grants to make up that $10 million shortfall here for the project on South Academy Boulevard. This is happening because construction costs for labor and materials keep rising. I have to take you to video now to give you a closer look at the project. It's to widen and improve South Academy from I-25 to the Bradley Road exit. The project cost $62 million when it went out to bid. Now, with actual construction starting this week, the price tag is now $71 million. And it'll be even more if costs keep increasing as they have. Plan 10 to 12 years in advance, typically. Uh, we usually will use anywhere from 5 to 10% as kind of a baseline for to account for potential inflation. Uh, we've in the last two years, we've seen increases of 15 to 20 percent for some material and labor. Now, the county engineer says that some materials cost as much as 30 percent more than they used to. The situation is also affecting a handful of other projects on Bradley and Galley roads that cost more as they advance from the design stage to the construction phase. And crews have already had to scale back some of the work here on South Academy, we learned today. That happened after they redesigned the project and found some cost savings there. They should know, the county should know, within a month or so, whether it will get the $10 million that it's going to apply for. We'll keep you posted. Live in South Colorado Springs, Scott Harris, KRDO, Shadow 13.